if something is so straightforward and easy that everybody wants it and loves it, right? It's going to be hard to get that thing at a discount. So kind of implied in the idea of having a discount or margin of safety is that there is some kind of supply demand imbalance uh, that you're sort of willing to take advantage of through the negotiations. Stocks are liquid, right? So they trade like every microsecond in the markets than when they're open. Real estate is relatively much less liquid, right? It takes months to turn a real estate asset into money. So during that time, there's all kinds of idiosyncratic factors. I mean, one of them, a lot of times if I'm looking for a house, I'll actually look to buy it in December or January, which is the slowest time for buyers, right? So you might have a house that otherwise would fly off the shelf in May, but because I'm happen to be looking in November and December and not that many people are wanting to you know, look at houses at that time uh, in the Northeast, it's winter. So I just have like kind of a better shot at more negotiating leverage. And why not, right? 